I see the lockbox. A lock safe from a police officer's storage unit. What do you think is in here and how do you think we get into it? Oh, oh. what in the heck is this? Another pair of handcuffs, another baton. Speak of collectibles, oh. holy crap, look at that. Whoa, so cool. I am so excited to be back at this $660 abandoned storage unit. I could literally barely sleep last night. Last time it was a jackpot and I know there's gonna be even more. Let's get back into it. Last time we learned that the unit owner was military and police, and we have this green toe that I'm really excited. This is duty stuff on it, so we're gonna work our way to that today because I have to see what's in there. First, let's see what Lindsay's cups look like. What kind of cups you got? Do you have silver ones, gold ones, something like that? Something other than plastic. Oh, uh, these Starbucks? I know the people do, there yeah, they are. Look, people do collect the Starbucks ones. You can sell them for a good amount on eBay. The Starbucks tumblers average somewhere between 10 and $35 a piece, but there are some very rare exceptions. So definitely worth checking. Let me also remind you that we ended part one of this storage unit with a total value of $1,600. So that is where we're gonna pick up from right now. Let's see, what is this? This is a figure. You think that's old? I don't know. It looks old. Porcelain. Yeah, the legs are purse. I said I was about to say porcelain. Porcelain. <laughs> the legs are porcelain. Look at some of these guys. What the heck? That looks old right there. Yeah. Or if it's not, it's really bad quality. I don't know what that's supposed to be. Let's open up one more of these and see. Are they all just little porcelain dolls? They are. So let's move these dolls out of the way and just get further down in here. I see Mickey Mouse. We might have some old Disney. Check this out. That, is, that doesn't look too old, actually. It should have a date over here. And it does not, of course, to prove me wrong, but a Mickey Mouse cup. And there's a Spider-Man cup. And there's two of these ones. Which are, what are these? Circle line, sightseeing. Yeah, I guess, you know. A lot of cups in there. I'm excited. Let's just keep going. See if this tote is only closed. It looks like it's closed, but it feels... No, nope, it's got other stuff in it, actually. I see Nintendo. You see that? Yep. I see Nintendo. If we can have an NES console, too. This unit has been specifically designed for me with video games and guns. There's somebody's graduation stuff. We'll make sure they get that back. That is the control deck for the original Nintendo. Man, we gotta find that system. I feel like it's gonna be in here somewhere. That's just closed. Anything else in here that isn't closed? A lot of camo. Whoa, what is that? that? Whoa, you could tell by feeling this. Look at the inside, I was about to say, you could tell this is 100% real fur. This is not something made in a factory. I don't know what it is, maybe a rabbit? What's your guess? Uh... I have no I idea. Know. I mean, probably I would guess that, a rabbit. Yeah. I would guess a rabbit. If you know, let me know down in the comments. There's more fur. Is it? That's oh, yeah. Dexter. Yeah, that's a Dexter one. See? <laughs> this is what we could have, but no, we got to keep the cat in the house, right? <laughs> yes. Joking. Joking. Oh. <laughs> There's a few cards in here. Personal stuff. We'll make sure they get back. Always flip through them, though, because we have found cash before, especially ones when the card's still in the envelope like this. I found cash. I found gift cards find all kinds of stuff like that but nothing's in there so they'll get those back what is this though school id put that over here um we got clothes belts clothes Let's look on the other side just to be sure there's another book well look at this something is new or what is this it looks like a tag to some kind of pair of pants i don't know what it went to originally but over here there's just a couple more books and then just more clothes. So I guess now we can pull out the box that says Nana stuff in it. So this is somebody's school ID I'm gonna put in the personal box here. I just wanna point out that it's their senior ID from 2011 to 2012, which means they graduated in 2012, same year I graduated. So somebody's my age exactly, which means hopefully, since we've been finding video games from my era already, then we'll find more of those. Let's see what's in this box, it's heavy. Ooh. All right, it Nana. just says Nana stuff on it. What Hopefully it's not Nana's clothes. Hopefully it's <laughs> Nana's like collectibles and things like that. I'm gonna pull out this PO box key and slice this thing open. You got a guess? Um, you said it's heavy. It's heavy. Coin collection. Know. That's what I'm talking about. That is what I'm talking about. <laughs> oh, let's see. Let me make sure this isn't a personal picture, is it? I don't know if I should show this on YouTube. It's not. It's not meant to be bad, but I feel like YouTube could be taken bad. It's like a mom giving their kid a bath. I'm just gonna avoid that whole thing. But it's like a really old picture. This looks like a lot of personal pictures in this box. We're gonna move some of these Willie Nelson CDs around. Let's just move some of all this around. I see boxes underneath of this, these pictures and CDs, so it's, I don't think it's all that. But definitely a lot of it. Like right here. Oh, that actually a photo album? That's a really old photo album. So again, we'll make sure they get that kind of stuff back. 
but what is this? That's an old flip phone. We got some more CDs. Are these pictures as well, you think? Try to open. Um, let's see. Yes, they are. Yeah, they're pictures as well. So this tote's looking like a lot of personal stuff, but I still want to dig all the way to the bottom. More photo albums, more pictures, and a giant photo album. This one's pretty much all personal. We'll make sure they get the whole box back. Now you can see the tote that I was referring to right here. Duty gear, that's gotta be either military or police gear, I'm thinking. This one's stuffed animals. I'm kinda actually interested to see what they have. What is this, just a moving blanket? Yeah. That's just a blanket, let's just get that out of the way. Let's take out the stuffed animals, I'm kinda curious. What's, oh, what is that? Ooh, I see some interesting stuff. Da, 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 da. You didn't see that. You didn't see none of that. You didn't see any of it. All right. You'll see it soon. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to see what kind of stuff the animals they had. Since I know they have people from my age group. Uh, you think this bag's going to open peacefully? No. It's going to have to get ripped. Get ripped. I don't rip it all the way. I'll just rip, I'll pull it a little bit so we can at least look inside. Uh, these are actually little kids. Is that the flying purple people eater? Looks like it. That's what it looks like. An Elmo. I was hoping there'd be like Pokemon or something like that. But no, it looks like little kids. I see more Sesame Street. I see Toys R Us in there, but I can't pull him out. Let's pull out the Toys R Us guy and see who he is, and that's it. This is Monkey. Is it Curious George or just a monkey? <laughs> no, I, I don't know, but a lot of stuffed animals. This is one of those things that's legally required to be in every single storage unit, an air mattress. Boo. Now comes the hard choice, right? What do you think? Duty gear or arts and crafts? Hmm. What do you want? What do you want? You know what? I'm feeling arts and crafts today. Okay. Not. We're taking duty <laughs> gear. Let's see what the I don't know screen if you want shows. To wait. I can't wait. When I'm genuinely excited, I don't have the patience like this. I just have to see too. What do you think? Military or police? Military. Let's see. I'm so excited right now. What's in the duty gear? Okay. What are? Th Ooh, look. Ooh. Handcuffs. Are they actually in there? Feels like they are. They're new. New <laughs> pairs of handcuffs still in the box. So I'm guessing that means police. Another pair of handcuffs. Is this a metal detector thing that they will go by when you like go on a show and do this with? I think so, what do you think? Yeah. This clipboard. There's the cop, the famous cop flashlight. Oh, it's in here. Ooh, hold on a second. Let's look in here really quick. Open up. What are these? These are look like holsters or something, don't they? Yeah, it looks like a Wii controller thing. Oh, this has to do with guns. I just know it. What is this? It's a Federal. Federal's an ammo brand. That's why I'm curious. Uh, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But if you know, make sure you let us know in the comments. Come back over here. What is that? I'm not too sure on that. Look how many handcuffs are in here. Another pair of handcuffs. More handcuffs. More handcuffs. Silver? Are they silver? I gotta take them out now. Why do you oh, put those on there? What? There's no way. It's like some collectible police thing. Silver handcuffs. Or maybe it's just meaning the color. Made in Korea. These are legit handcuffs. This is crazy cool. Interesting though. Let's put that back in the box. Go back in there. I'll get you later. This? This is the gun. Right here. Bang. Oh no. What is that? A camera? Is this a speed gun? Warner Brothers security. Oh, secure. I thought it was a thing they sit on the side of the road with like this and just wait for you and catch you speeding. Not too sure. It says security, so I'm guessing a camera. Turns out it's actually a night vision scope and it's sold for $100, but what's weird is ours has a sticker that says Warner Brothers security on it. So not sure if that would add value. Let's just put this over here. That looks like a holster to me or something. Or maybe it's to hold this. Is this a baton? Oh. Do you want to get it? <laughs> I will take you out. Nice. Don't play with me. How do you put this thing back? Just hit it? I have no idea. Well, we'll figure that out later. A freaking baton. Oh, a brand new one. Nice. Brand new police baton. Another one. Oh, can I do it again? What'd you say to me? Leaving hate comments on my videos? You want to get this across the shin? I bet you don't. You're not gonna feel good. That one went down easy. <laughs> Look at this. More handcuffs. Another pair of handcuffs. Another baton. This is crazy. What is that right here? Alexandria Police Department. In fair, that is so weird. I was born at Alexandria Hospital. Lived there 20 years. That's where I grew up at. 
it's so weird seeing all this because we're pretty far away from there right now. These, are these actual pens and stuff? Or are these just generic type things? Let's see. Somebody in the comments know? Because if they're obviously something they earned, we want to make sure we get it back to them. But if it's just something like collectible, then obviously we're going to keep them. Uh, this has um, his name on it. So I'm going to go ahead and assume these are personal. We'll make sure they get this bag back right there. Let's see. Another flashlight. Oh, whoa. Look at all these. Are these all military pins? Let's look Even in the here. badges. They're all badges, aren't they? Whoa. That's a lot. Look at all these. I don't see anything. Look at that. Metropolitan Police from, ooh, DC Police. These are all, look at that. Look. They're Pinkerton Captain. Man, it's all badges and military pins. Look at that, private security. That's cool. Security enforcement. What are these over here? More security enforcement officer. So probably a cop that did like security on the side, if I had to guess. Let's see, what are these? You see that? Yeah. It's weird. I wonder what's in here. Let's check it out. They are something. They're a bunch of pins again. Security pins. That's pretty cool. Is that the same thing in the other one too? Let's check it out. Is it all the way down? Same thing. A bunch of pins and patches and stuff like that. Just more of the same. That's freaking cool. Anything else in here? Is this a handcuff container maybe? And then that looks like something personalized. Oh, the little radio. I can buzz people. He's speeding. He's going 70 and a 65. Let's waste our time and get him. And then, just kidding. A knife and one final baton. Is this the thing that keeps it on your belt maybe? So you just take it off and beat the crap out of somebody. That's a fun tote. Hey, you better leave this video a thumbs up right now because this unit is insane. And make sure you subscribe if you're new because it's going to take us a while to go through this one. Plus, we buy storage units all the time. Now let's go into the Arctic Craft Box. Let's see what's in this one. Ooh, that was so cool, man. I, just, I love that kind of stuff. I think it's so cool to find. Arctic Craft, not quite as much, but we'll see what's in there. That's definitely what it says. So far, every box we've pulled out of this storage unit has been labeled correctly. So a bunch of like foam letters, strings. Is that like glitter glue or glitter paint? Even worse. That stuff, glitter is just awful, guys. So more stickers. We got markers. Whole bunch of crafting stuff in here and art stuff. Bungee cords. I guess that could be used for different things. This is crayons. What's in this coat? It's more arts and crafts. So, oh, what is this? Hold on. You see this tote here? Security services. That doesn't seem like arts and craft to me. Oh, they used it for it. <laughs> All right, fair enough. Fair enough. There's another one of those containers down here. Let's see if that's the same thing. If it is, then I'm just going to assume it's all arts and craft. Yeah, I think this box is all arts and crafts. It's definitely going to be worth something, though, because crafters, crafting stuff is expensive. So they'll definitely see some of this stuff at one of our upcoming live auctions, that's for sure. It looks like there's a lot of collectibles in these totes, but I don't want to get there yet. Should I try to pull this bag out or just get that box next? <laughs> get the box. All right, play it safe, huh? Ugh. Let's see. What's that? Okay, I'm going to act like I didn't read that. Let's see what's in this box right here. It, oh, speak of collectibles. Oh. Holy crap, look at that. Man, you picked the right thing this time. That's signed. Cool. That's crazy. Look at this. They have a lot of NASCAR signatures. Kiss. That's cool. Kiss NASCAR. Just as a reference point, that one single car sells for $22. Keep that in mind once you see the pure quantity here. This one's signed. Again. This is insane. Look at this NASCAR hat here. Man, the quantity of cars we have. Jamie, or Jamie McCurry, I don't know these people's names. McMurray. McMurray. Uh, I guess that doesn't mean, or have anything to do with my reading abilities, huh? Tony Stewart, a couple of whisk cars. Okay, then you're gonna help me, because I think, know nothing. I think this one's Casey Kane. Okay. Number nine. I know nothing. Look at all these, though. That is just insane how many cars they have. This is awesome. This one right here says Denny Hamlin limited edition at the top that's the one that he had all the signatures for okay there's another one what are these big guys here hmm Ooh, let's what open is it. It? why does it say sharpie on it is it something signed i'm wondering 
that's what I'm assuming when it says Sharpie on it. Open up, open up. Oh no, it's a brand new. Like, I don't even want to touch it. You see that? It's a Sharpie car. Like, the Sharpie sponsored it okay. for the race. And it's like brand spanking new. Man, this unit right now. This is what I live for. Our last two units. This yeah. one and the one before it. Woo! Check this out. More NASCARs. A Madagascar one. Uh, what are these? Man, it goes all the way down. Look at this. All these are in there. Here's another one that's still in the box. There's like, holy crap, look down here. This one, okay, this one feels empty. The oh. one, the Dale Earnhardt <laughs> one. It's the first one I pick up, doesn't feel heavy. Unless it's just a really light car. I don't want to rip the box. Or how do I take it out? Ugh. It's like stuck. I'm gonna open it just because I want to see. All the other ones felt like they had significant weight to them. This one does not. Okay, let's see. See, I'm not crazy. Okay. That's the one that's empty. Thank you, Mayor. I had to be sure. It may have took 10 minutes to do so. Man, this is crazy. I'm not even a NASCAR fan, but I'm a collector and I respect people's collections. And this is cool. So look at all this. I don't know what that is. More cars, more cars. This one right here, is that a knife or what? Doesn't it look like a knife blade? Industrial tool? What is that? Is it just a sponsor again, I'm assuming? What would you Maybe. think? Should I open I, it? I mean, I would say so just because there is a driver's name on it. Let's see if it's actually a knife or a car. It looks like the same box. Yeah, it's another car. That's the thing with NASCAR. They have so many sponsors that like, I always get confused on the boxes. So I don't know if it's going to be something pertaining to that or just they happen to sponsor a car. But look down here. One, two, three of the replicas. Look at all these cars over here. Jamie Murray. Man. And this is one, two, three more. Who knows how many hundreds of dollars that one box is worth. This unit is insane. You want a giant cotton arm or something? Sure. Soft, crafty polyester battering. And turn it into a pillow. Okay, that works. Let's go, which, what do you think? White tote, blue tote? Blue. Blue. Well, let's get this one down right here. What do you think it is? Uh more ammo police stuff i wish you were right it's more of these though like these things are like weird because they do sell for us so they're, they're like money but it's like i feel like every time we found them it's like you don't find two you find like hundreds every single time you come across them we already found one full tote this is full tote number two and it kind of scares me about these other blue totes but i guess we'll see the white one kind of started sliding on its own so we have to take a little bit of a jump start now Smash my poor finger. Is this one all books and papers? Uh, and a vacuum tube, a CD. But other than that, let me see what's in one of these manila envelopes just to make sure it's not money or collectibles or anything like that. These are actually school pictures. So this will be something we get and we make sure they get back. Now let's check in those blue totes. What do you think? Sewing patterns or something different? It's heavy again. <laughs> it feels like the same exact way as the last one. I'm scared of all the blue totes now. Well, hey, look, a Ninja Turtle one. That's different. But, yeah, a bunch more sewing patterns. So I'm just going to set this one right here for now. And let's just get this last one out the way. Ugh, don't fall. Oh, this one's significantly lighter than the other, so maybe this one's not. Oh, yeah, this one's different. What is this? This uh, uh photo album? Yeah. And, well, what is this? Just the jar? this in it what's in the middle a smaller jar and a bigger jar this looks like winnie the pooh's honey pot <laughs> let's see let's just set it down here what's on this side another jar okay so the personal stuff here i'll make sure they get back and other than that it's just jars what's this okay some pins and a tape measure weird who wants some green blue giant like water jugs i'm guessing to water a garden or water flowers other than that I wouldn't have a clue what these are for. This tote, I'm really excited for. It looks like it's full of more collectible stuff. And if it is, I'm going to be in a good mood. That's exactly what it looks like, isn't it? Well, besides this, I don't really know what this goes to. This might go to whatever this is. I'm not really sure. It looks like a bunk bed set, maybe. Yeah. Is that, what is that? Is that part of his uniform, maybe? Mm, like collectible, race use, sheet metal, and tire. Oh, that is cool. I don't even collect it again. I just respect collectors because i'm a collector just not a nascar that is a flag did you just zoom in his face yeah. hey 
Whoa, cool. There, that's the one that was supposed to be in the box. Oh, okay, look. There's a whole like tractor trailer, Home Depot truck. Oh, so we got Jamie Murray. No, Jamie McMurray. Sorry, I don't know how to read. This one's empty, but it's probably one of these that are out of the box. So this was in a display case. That makes me think maybe it's more valuable than the others, or maybe that was just one of their favorites. I don't know. That's always the thing with collectibles. They could be just a favorite personal, or it could be of more value. Check that one out. That's pretty cool too. Let's put that guy right here. There's a nice pickup truck. What is that? See the truck? That looks cool. What is this guy right here? <clears throat> you gotta pull him out. Oh well. Look at all these individual cars. This is crazy. I don't think we've ever found this many collectible like toys or cars or stuff in a unit before. There's a military version. A couple more. Let's get this out the way. You see all these individual boxed ones down there? That is crazy to me. I love it. There's another orange one. And there's another 124th scale. Now, what's this guy? Uh, the monster. What? <laughs> Mile. Never mind. I I, I didn't. Uh, I didn't see the E. I thought it was an F. Maybe you catch my drift. To... <laughs> <laughs> maybe you're supposed to be holding a car. Oh, maybe that's actually. Cool. Oh, look. It's. Oh, there's only three thousand of these made. It's a uh, collectible for sure. Only three thousand of them in the world. And then we have some race car tickets over here. I think the only other thing was this, isn't it? Yeah. What is that? That is just a, a license plate thingy, but man, the amount of collectibles in here is just insane. I want to get this other toad out, but this thing's kind of blocking it. Let's just throw some of these blankets like this Ugh. over here. Now you can see the military bag that I pointed out in the first video I saw early on. Let's see what's in here. I feel like it's fishing. What do you think? Sounds like fishing. Yeah, it does. Let's see. Ooh, Zelda. A Zelda collector's puzzle. Is that what's in there, though? Yeah, that's cool. Let's see. So maybe this is all gaming stuff. <clears throat> maybe this is where that NES is. Let's check it out. Come out, you. It's like stuck. Ugh. Okay. What is this stuff yeah. here? What you got? I don't know. I was trying to. I heard stuff falling around. I was trying to catch it, but it doesn't look like okay. anything significant. Okay. I don't even know what these are. Together, best what? Cooperation? Hmm, what is this stuff? This is weird. Is this like vape stuff? Man, I hate when I'm just like completely clueless. I mean, these are incense. Yeah, these are. I don't know what the other thing is. All right, let's see what else is in here. Um, what the heck is this exactly? This looks like, I feel like it has to do something with smoking. What would you guess? Uh, yeah. Because of this piece? I mean, I don't know what else it could be. What else is in there? A uh, death scary looking CD. There's more stuff down here though. These are some cosmic innovation, some old, a $2 scratch off winner, another $2 winner, and a $1, $5 in winners. You think they're still valid? I could try. When did they expire? Let's see. Oh, it had to be cashed by 2013. Only nine years late. I think we can make it. Um, whoa, what's this? This stuff is weird. I have no idea what I'm dealing with right now. Stuff. Yeah, I believe it has to be that too. I couldn't think of anything else. Well, look at this necklace. If that's silver, that's a lot of silver right there. Ah, it does have a marking on it, but I can't read it. What do you think? Does it look similar? <laughs> Maybe. Um, yeah, I mean, a little bit. <laughs> I guess we'll see. Uh, and other than that, it's just a lot of paperwork. It's just a weird bag. Before I pull out this tote, I want to point out two things. Number one, this military bag as hard as can be which makes me think there's something in there number two there's a box in a thing all the way up in that top left corner you see the green colored military bag in that box that just says knickknacks that's got me really curious too because this unit just has so much cool stuff but let's go ahead and pull this tote out which looks like oh yeah like it's gonna be a crap ton of collectibles look at this bang 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 you see all these little official um, stickers to the top too? Yeah. That is crazy. This probably looks so cool and displayed once upon a time. A lot of Dale Earnhardt here. What is this? Oh, I called it. Did you see that reflex? Yeah. Basically a ninja. Look at all these. This is just so crazy. There's not even enough room to like set them everywhere. But there's another Dale Earnhardt Jr. one. Uh, look at these guys. Look at that one. It's got Santa on it. And then we got besides the miniature cars, you got some of the one 
well, that was bound to happen. Some of the 124th scale cars here. Look down there. These are all trucks underneath of it. You see that? One, two, three, four of the trucks. Then there's a whole bunch of these ones over here called Winter Circle. Let's just get one out. So they look like that. Little miniature ones, Winter Circle cars. And then over here, looks like we got more bigger guys. Mm -hmm. That's another, is that Dale Earnhardt? What number yeah. is he? Okay. Eight. And then over here, it looks like more than, what's this paper here? Is that a picture? Yeah, that's a picture of somebody from 1999. Wow. Um, a lot more cars. I mean, I love to see it, but I'm just at the point where like, I don't even know what to say about it. There's so many of them. It's just freaking awesome. How much money right now? Go down in the comments, take your guess, how much money you think we have total in NASCAR collectibles so far? Because we still have a lot more to go through. I just tried to pull this black and yellow toad and it is insanely heavy. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Hope it doesn't crush these boxes. Okay, what in the world is in this thing? That's the question I want to see. You don't get to see. <laughs> Whoa, so cool. No, I don't really know what it is. I'm just trolling you. What? That's a military. Yep. Training guy, Marine training guide. So Marines. Let's see. This is journals over here. Some type of blue journal. If somebody's familiar with the military, let me know if that's what they're used for. Um, what else? What's in here? Is this a phone or a camera? It's an old phone. Look at that. Put that back in here. This looks like it might be a lot of paperwork and stuff. We're gonna dig through it though, just to find out. Oh, oh, I see the lock box. First, what's this? Ooh, that looks cool too. What do we have here? Oh, nice. whoa, that is awesome. Police badges and everything. Man, that's cool, that lock box though. I saw that too. I saw that too. Come here, big boy. It's definitely full. And it's locked. No. No. All right. This has to be said here for a second because we got to figure out what's in there. Let's keep going down. Nothing in there. Tax papers in those manila envelopes is what it's labeled. And since everything else is correct, I'm going to trust that it's labeled correctly. Let's get some of this over. See what's in this box here. What does that say? dresser stuff that can mean a lot of things that looks like a display case for something what is it Ugh. well look at that first another nascar wall plaque right there this was a display case for i don't know what whatever it is obviously not in there anymore something nascar look at the bottom yeah, oh look right here maybe it might be this truck right here or this car right here what is it? Oh, look at that. What is that thingy right here? Ah, get back here. It's a little victory lane pin. I think that car may, might have went in there. What? I thought that was a button. Oh, I was like, am I missing something? <laughs> but look at the bottom of uh, this thing. It says something NASCAR on it. Oh, yeah, look. Statement of authenticity. This race used memorabilia. Oh, cool. So I wonder, these, I don't think they would wear ties. I wonder if this could be the shirt they wore or something. I have no idea. It's definitely something we gotta figure out. Is there anything underneath of this box here? Um, not that I'm seeing. I'm seeing a whole lot. These are those old disposable cameras. And the rest of it looks like office stuff. But now we gotta figure out how to get into the safe. A locked safe from a police officer's storage unit. What do you think is in here and how do you think we get into it? Should I just try the old fashioned brute force method? I mean, it worked on the <laughs> safe containing $3,000 and we found before, so. <laughs> it did, that was pretty crazy. Oh, you're pretty strong. <laughs> not you're strong, a strong enough. Strong fella. Not strong enough. <laughs> one more time, one more time. Come All right, on. I'll cheer you on, ready? Ready? Guys, say it with me. Come on. Hercules, Hercules, ah. there you go. Oh, it's empty. What the heck? <laughs> it felt so full though. Really? I thought for sure that felt like it had something in it, but it's just an empty box. I'm sad now. That's one of these black and yellow totes in that back corner. Let's see. Ooh, this one looks interesting. <laughs> you know, oh, whoa. No. Oh, Aww. this could be a bottom half though. Oh, look right here. Oh, whoa. what in the heck is this? This is the lower half. Ooh, it's a paintball though. 
No. no. I thought this was like a lower half of a rifle. Man, that looks legit. Yeah, it does. Cool. So, let's see. A cast. Some more military stuff. Let's keep moving back. This is, remember earlier we found one of these and had the Nixon newspaper in it last yeah. time? Nothing in there this time. Oh, there's just a magazine laying there in the open. That's not for paintballs. Nope. Let's see what's in this little thing here. Ooh, coins. Nice. Let's see what kind of coins. These are all foreign coins, they look like. Oh, I just missed one. Get back here. So we'll put them all just back in there for now. Let's move this thing around here and see. That looks like the um, thing to hold the paintballs. Just another photo album. Yes, put that in the return pile. That too. Um, what is that? Whoa. 100% plastic playing cards. What? Let me see. I just want to see what it looks like. That's weird. Yeah, I'm going to give it to oh. Brandon. He's like weirdly <laughs> obsessed with playing cards. I ruined it. Yeah, I don't know what to do with it. Uh, set it here. All right, let's see. More paintball stuff. This is paintballing. What is this? Another paintball tank. Yeah, another paintball tank. NASCAR stuff. Let's keep just scooting it over, checking underneath every little crevice. Um, what are these here? <gasps> tech decks! Oh. Tech decks! And One the, of the wheels and stuff. Yes, yeah, so these are all tech deck kits. Man, these were so fun. I remember playing with these so much when I was in elementary school. This, this one's got like eight boards in it too. Nice. That's awesome. And that one's full. I didn't even Look notice that. Side. Look at that. Holy crap. Nice. That is awesome. You can't even be mad at that. That was pretty funny. It was funny, but it, nonetheless, <laughs> it's still kind of annoying. Now they're gonna clean all that up. <laughs> Here's a blank book. <laughs> I still in disbelief that just watch that. Ooh, what is this? What is this right here? Let's check what's in this thingy. Come on, something cool, something cool. What the heck? What is this? Uh. <laughs> no idea. What's the other thing in there? Come out, come out, come out, wherever you are. There's more in here. It says something stand on it. What so does it's... this say? <gasps> it's your word. Hercules stand. <laughs> It's for me. I don't think that's supporting <laughs> my big self. Um, nothing else that I'm seeing down there right now, but we'll definitely look into these totes in more detail. I am mind blown by this storage unit. We've only gone through like a third of it. Look how much more is left, guys. Make sure you're subscribed and make sure you come back next time to see the next part. Peace out.